realized that we're going to be doing a challenge for the kids next week, here's what we're going to do. I'm going to do a stance hack, stance martial arts hack. I'm going to do 11 of the martial arts stances that we do in our program, and I'm going to show you every single stance. Then what I'm going to do is I'm going to shoot another video that's going to show you a transition from each stance to the next stance, and I want to see the kids perform that. If they perform that, I have a prize for them uh, when they come back from break. All right, so here we go. We're going to start with our first stance. Our first stance is going to be our attention stance. So in my attention stance, I want my feet to come together, my hands inside, knuckles inside my hand just like so, right foot is in, right hands are together, or right hand comes into the left. All right, that's our attention stance. Our next stance is our ready stance. We do this all the time. Our ready stance, we want our hands right by our waist, two fists in a vertical position, our knees are slightly bent, just like so. All right, our next stance is our Son Shin stance. Okay, this is a little bit more advanced for some of our beginner kids. They haven't learned this one yet, but I'm gonna show you that one. Okay, in my Son Shin stance, I wanna have my toes in and my heels pushed out and my knees are bent in. So I'm in this position just like so. That is my Son Shin stance. My next stance is gonna be our forward stance. So I'm gonna take my right foot in front, or whatever foot, doesn't matter. My right foot's gonna be in front. I wanna make sure that my shoulders are over my hips. My front knee is bent, my back leg is facing straight ahead and my hands are up. Everything is facing forward. This is my forward stance. All right. My straddle stance. I'm going to show you the straddle stance from the front position. All right. The straddle stance, I want to have my feet double shoulder the part, and I want to try to take my knees, and I want to push my knee tension out and have my back straight. So just like this, this is called a straddle stance, and I can have my hands up this way. Excellent. Okay, our next one is our cat stance, all right? My cat stance, I'm gonna be on the ball of my front foot. Okay, my back foot's gonna be at a 45 degree angle. All of my weight should be on my back leg and my hands will be up just like so. This is the cat stance. The next stance that we're gonna do is going to be the long forward stance. The long forward stance is almost like I'm stretching. My front foot is going all the way forward. My front knee is bent, my back leg is locked out. In this stance though, my back foot can be facing to the side because it gives me a little more balance and stability for the stance. Long forward stance. All right, our next stance is our back stance. Okay, our back stance is, I'm gonna have my front foot in front and my back leg in the back, and instead of having my, my leg locked out, my knee will be bent and my hands will be up like so, and this is called a back stance. All right. Our next stance is our sumo stance. All right, so our sumo stance kind of goes with the straddle stance. So if in my straddle stance like so, okay, I have my knee tension pushed out. When I'm gonna do a sumo stance, I wanna take my toes and push my toes out just like so. Kind of makes me look like a sumo wrestler. All right. Our next stance is our cross stance. Our cross stance, my front foot's gonna be facing on a 45 degree angle. My left knee comes behind, and I'm on the ball of that back foot. So if I turn this way, you'll kinda of see I'm on the ball of the back foot. My knees are bent, my hands are up. This is called a cross stance. My next stance that we're gonna do, this is number 11, we're gonna do our crane stance. My crane stance, I pick my leg up, my right foot comes inside, my hands come up like so. All right, those are your 11 stances. That's your martial arts, uh, 11 stance martial arts stance hack. All right, we're gonna come back to this and I'm gonna show you how to transition through all these stances. All right, you guys have a great week. Make sure you take the time to view these videos and go over the different stances with your kids. And parents, I wanna see you involved as well. Okay, see you soon.